Kim Holmes and I are going to explain the Returning the Nails movement, which we want to get going through this GoFundMe campaign. I'll let Tim explain the context first. Hello, my name is Tim Holmes. I'm a sculptor and an artist. I was researching ancient metallurgy techniques when I discovered, much to my surprise, that in biblical times, iron was more valuable than even gold. The reason is because in the Bronze Age, iron was the only metal that would hold a sharp edge, and therefore it became the preferred tool of war. As such, it was seen as a strategic material, much like nuclear technology is for us today. It was so valuable, in fact, that even smelting techniques were a highly controlled state secret. So, if iron nails were used for a crucifixion, afterwards, I think it would have been up to the family of the victim to return the nails to the ruling power. And so, I created this bronze called Returning the Nails Endurance, depicting Mary, the mother of Jesus, returning the nails to the Roman authorities upon having removed her son's body from the cross. To me, this presents us a universal symbol of defiance. It represents the ascendancy of moral righteousness above the heartless authority of pure power. Surely in your own life, you have suffered the indignity of having your humanity overruled by some great power that holds your freedom and perhaps your very life totally in its control. By symbolically returning the nails to that power, you declare that your human dignity is more powerful than any earthly authority. And much as that authority may hold your very life in its hands, it can never rule your heart. By returning to that power, the tools of violence that it uses against you, you can declare that although any coward can use violence to achieve quick results to their advantage, ultimately, the power of love will always prevail over the love of power. By returning the nails, each one of us can take back our dignity. The initial objective of this campaign is to return nails in the form of postcards like this to oil and gas company executives and politicians who are standing in the way of legislation and American public policy on climate change. For each $5 raised, we will send a postcard to a targeted executive or politician. We will collaborate with any activist group, providing postcard designs and making the story available for any legal use. You can find the necessary images at the returningthenails.net website. Print them out and mail them. If we can raise $15,000, the Archetype in Action organization will award the Returning the Nails Conviction statuette to Greta Thunberg of Sweden for her courageous work in speaking truth to power. All funds raised above the basic costs and the cost of sending the postcards will be directed to a nonprofit organization of Greta's choice after the award to allow her to continue the fight. These are some example postcard ideas you can find at returningthenails.net. Please contribute. Thank you. Mm -hmm.